disgruntledduck.com. So welcome guys, back again. Uh, another review video. This time it's the Tamiya Toyota Corolla World Rally Championship scale model. This is in a 1 to 24 scale. Okay, let's, uh, let's unbox this. So, what have we got? Okay, start with, it's quite a simple kit. There's no engine or anything in this, but uh, there's a lot to get your teeth into. So, first off, uh, solid shell body, all one piece. Nice. There's not really any flash on there. Um, this model is white, so I think we could possibly work straight onto that without actually painting it. Um, we'll, we'll decide on that later though. But a nice bit of detail uh, on the bumper, on the rear. Um, I'm interested how this rear part's going to go in here. I'm expecting this all to be uh, clear plastic. But yeah, it's a nice shell to start with. Uh, next, right, clear plastic. There's a hell of a lot of it. But one thing I do like is they've given you a free set of masks to uh, mask off all those for painting, so that's pretty cool. Uh, normally those cost a couple of quid if you buy them aftermarket, so that's a nice little touch. Right, um, rear window, I'm guessing this little guy is going to go in there. Um, got some nice rear headlights, rear, well brake lights, the headlights are detailed quite nicely. I'm not too sure about this piece, um, but I'm sure when we dig into the instructions we're going to find out what that's for. A solid piece to cover all the windows, side and uh, front windscreen. So that's going to save a little bit of fiddling around, gluing wi uh, windows in individually. That's nice. Um, right, the bulk of it. So as this is a ray car, as you can expect, uh, some severe um, suspension on there. Nice chunky wheels. A lot of detail on the underneath. As I said, there's no engine, so we're gonna have to paint this part of the engine in situ on the bodywork. Uh, again, nice bit of detail all the way around, but these parts can have to be painted individually. Would be nice if they were separate. We could paint them up, uh, paint them up first, and then stick them on later. But it is what it is. It was quite a reasonable kit. Um, I think 15 to 20 pound this one costs, so you might expect you're not going to get the engine or as much detail as some of the 30 or 40 pound kits. You've got some of the roll bars here, uh, more of the details, looks like part of the bumper, uh, some of the transmission. So there are a few little bits we're going to stick on afterwards, so that's nice. Uh, the next part the mainly what's in the cockpit so we've got some nice racing seats got the dashboard uh, we've got a few bits to go in the front by the engine the fans whatnot side doors windscreen wipers um, got the gear stick and looks like a handbrake possibly uh, there's the exhaust down the sides uh, nice steering wheel there's a there's a decent bit of detail it's not incredible um, but yeah that's not too bad that's not too bad at all. Right, finally, we've got some tyres, rubber tyres, which are nice. We've got a little bit of mesh, and we've got these little uh, little gimmicks to hold the wheels on. So, yeah, I reckon it should be a nice little afternoon project, actually. It's going to take a little while to paint it, and the most important part, which was one of the reasons I actually picked out this kit, because I wanted to practice on this, was the amount of decal application on this vehicle. So you can see there is quite a fair bit of decal work to do. So basically that's what's in the box of the Toyota Corolla. There's the body, there's the decals. As always, a Tamiya kit so you know you can have some really simple instructions to work for it. So yeah, this is definitely a nice little kit. It's not that advanced. Of course, if you want, you're gonna be able to put some more detail into that, but I think this is a lovely little kit, especially for someone like me who's really starting off 
against the cars. Um, yeah, so let's make this up. I'm gonna make up as it is, factory fresh, no weather or anything. I'll try and get a nice finish on that. And let's see how we go on this. So until next time, see you later. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment.